Welcome back to my first playthrough of Control. We just defeated Tomis Tomiso, I think. Tomiso. Uh, quite the spammy little malaka. We, we kind of made a mess down there, but in the end we got it. He dead now. Um, let me go and see if I can pick anything up down there because I was cheesing him upstairs. So now we need to go to the unknown caller, find the hotline object of power. Okay, we're still on the hunt for the telephone thing. I know from my experience with the Alan Wake games that it's very important to read every note that you find. So I'm making sure that I look in every corner and every cranny that I will pick up every little piece of paper that might have any information about the plot and whatnot to figure this out. So um, I will I will also read everything. So I hope you guys don't mind. It's going to be a very thorough playthrough with lots of reading. Tomasi. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much. That was the name. Okay. Hey, Malcolm. Yes. Tea time is at seven. I'll see you at the course on Sunday morning. By the way, have you heard about this Tennyson report? Apparently, there's a bunch of copies drifting around the, the office. Trench is looking to get his hands on any information about who wrote it. You wouldn't happen to have heard anything about that, would you? See you Sunday, Jim. His elevated. Ooh. Field research on his entity. His elevated agent. Confidential. His elevated agents display abilities similar to telekinetic... Con competencies observed in bureau para utilitarians some prefer to charge their targets while others launch objects at them telekinetic attacks have been ineffective against the his elevated due to their own talent in the area they do not use any weaponry except their own paranatural capabilities some his elevated have been levitating while strapped into chairs <laughs> This is likely the result of individuals being corrupted while undergoing cognitive recording and parapsychology. How are they able to use paranatural abilities? It is possible that these individuals were bound to objects of power prior to corruption. It's also worth considering that the His resonance can identify and express latent paranatural ability in the individuals it corrupts. Refer to file <laughs> for full report. They always send you to other files, which you then can't find because you don't you don't know the name and the number of the file. <laughs> okay, we are supposed to go to the big there somehow. Okay, so upstairs we go. Upstairs we go. I think. Hang on, there's a... Oh, yeah. Through here. I hope I've been in every room now. I'm not sure. I might not have been. Let's look around a bit more. Emotional damage. It's Ati! I hear Ati! Sing it, Adi. I love him, man. He's the greatest. if I could pick up corpses. What the hell just happened? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, I wanted to see if I could pick up the, the corpse guy. And, um... I kind of destroyed the entire building. Oh my god. <laughs> Boom. Alright. Um, Metal Gamer, thanks for the five month reset with Prime. Enjoy the emotes. Welcome back. Okay, I'm very low on health now, and now I need to go back and pick up the little orby thingies that these uh, guards left around. How did you get in the ground in the first place? <laughs> how did... How, how, how did that happen? Uh, anyways. I try to find my way back down to the... Ah, there, the stairs. Because I kind of um, hurt myself a little bit. I hurt myself today by eating something big. 
right into my face. There. This is where we go, I think. I think... Before I eat something else in my face, let's just go into this building now and into this into this room. Bam! Holy moly, what is this place? Oh. Case files. Oh. Butte summary? Event summary. A spate of disappearances was traced at, to a home in the city of Butte. Buddy? I, I don't know how to pronounce it. Where bureau agents discovered a translocative, translocative light switch cord. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Is this the clicker stuff? A light switch cord. Hmm. Hmm. Event response. Bureau agents arrived at the home of a local celebrity. Loca this is totally Ellen Wick. A local celebrity? A click, click, clickety thing cord? Located at hmm, 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 which had been connected to a total of hmm, disappearances in the area. Agents found no one inside. While searching a closet, an agent pulled the light switch cord and disappeared from you. <gasps> Another agent was... Oh, this is exciting. Um, was selected to pull the cord in order to replicate the event. He disappeared as well. Both agents were discovered at the oldest house hmm, days after. Uh, found later. They, oh God, I can't read. I'm so excited. <laughs> at the oldest house hmm, 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 days later. Found in a sealed room by rangers exploring a new area of the house. The light switch cord in the Butte Holmes closet disappeared during the incident. Buddy? I, I, don't, I don't know. How the hotline can't be far now. Oh, guys, I'm all hypers. I'm so excited for this. Launch efficiency. Energy, energy recovery. That That is now for the gun, right? Personal mods. No, this is just... Okay. So this is just me, and these are the mods for my weapon. Okay. Um, right now, what do we have equipped? Energy recovery, 18%. We can also equip... Minus 7% launch energy cost. Uh, energy boost plus 6. Health recovery per element pickup. Ah, these little thingies, okay. Health recovery per element pickup plus 20. Plus 26 is definitely better. Energy recovery speed. Oh, there's more. Alberto Tomasi, head of comm. Federal agent. Tomasi, Alberto. Can I zoom in? Uh, issue date, 2016. Okay. The hiss got him. Hotline chamber. Alright, I guess we... I know my way. The hiss got him. Alan Wake and Control from the same universe. Yeah, but like literally mentioning the clicker or like what I think is the clicker. Or something similar is pretty cool. I, I love when stories come together like this. I hear the ringing. <laughs> Hotline chamber. Hmm. These pictures sometimes need some time to, to be loaded, huh? They start all pixelated and then... Boop. Oh, yeah, I, see, I see there was another thing that I missed. Hotline security. Log. Trench, trench, Bill Everett, custodian. Trench, trench, Bill Everett, custodian. Trench, 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 Bill. Trenched Bill. Carol Bishop. Suddenly a new person. Supplement. According the, to their testimony, the agents had been transported from the Butte home to a roadside motel named the Ocean View Motel and Casino and discovered a room key by performing a ritual. Wait a minute, the Ocean View Motel and Casino? Is it from the first game with Barry and Ellen? I have some memories of this. Or maybe I'm just mixing things up, I don't know. 
and discover the room key by performing a ritual. See the file MOT01. The key opened a door marked with an inverted black pyramid, which they only learned after a lengthy period of trial and error. After pulling another motel cord found inside the room, they were transported to the oldest house. The disappearances of the home's owner and the other locals of Butte have been attributed to the light switch cord. The Ocean View Motel is now known to have many doors and pathways. Since the occurrence, identical light switch cords to the one found in the Butte home has be have begun appearing throughout the oldest house. At the time of writing, <laughs> light cords have been found in the oldest house located in the <laughs> and <laughs> sectors. These all access the Ocean View Motel though how exactly this link operates is <laughs> but initial hypotheses center on the butte a w e as a <laughs> see dr darling presentation oh my god oh, maybe i'm just like seeing connections where there aren't any but i'm very curious about all this hello hello baby Green logic. The light switch cord. The door marked with the black pyramid. I wanted to test if I could walk over there. And I was like, huh. I think I might fight, fall down, but no way. Don't tell me I have to fight this guy again. Thank God. All right, take this down. The situation in Cuba has been evaluated by the relevant authorities. The mysterious illness affecting the staff at the U.S. Embassy in Havana was caused by sonic weaponry in the hands of a foreign power. Numerous personnel have damage to the inner ear, but most are expected to make a full recovery. Of course, the event also damaged their cellular walls, but we can't blame that on some stupid noise gun. <laughs> Thank God no local doctors examined them first. Honestly, what are the odds an altered item would show up inside a U.S. Embassy? Talk about good luck, huh? <laughs> so much easier to... Hey, are you still recording this? You know, guys, all of this was planned because I think I missed this one. <laughs> so, obviously, this was all intended. Yep. Okay, but what am I gonna do with you now? Now what? Stand here. Notice. Ocean View, motel, and casino entry point. Catalyst, light switch. The law... Oh, three applies. Wait. No, I'm still here. Oh, do I have to turn it off and on again? <laughs> Maybe that it works? Okay. Been here before? Okay, just got to do it a few no. times. I've stayed at a lot of roadside motels across the country, on the road, on the run, under the radar. This feels like all of them, like something recognized from a dream. You tell me, baby. Customer. Anyone here? Okay, I'm locked in here. I know I need to go to the room with the upside black pyramid, but I want to have a look see around, you know? Being thorough and all. Why is there a red light coming out of here? I'm curious. What, what is this? Suspicious behavior in 226. Okay, I guess I can't do anything else, so I'm gonna ding the bing again. Ding a bing. And then we go, what is this? Janitor? Ati! What's with 
with the blue light. Bruh. I heard something. Hello? <gasps> this door opened! Keys! A key has a black pyramid on it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know exactly where that fits. Oh. Okay, let's go. You just gotta bing a ding a ding for some time and then doors open. Wait, that's the same one, right? No, wait a minute. I wasn't the one all the way back, but it looks exactly the same. Is there anything in here? Ooh, I like this. Okay, let's try again. Okay, but it just opens the ones on the sunny side, right? It doesn't open the ones... Um, the, for these ones. That's a bit of a shame. Yeah, okay. Well, can I open you? Nope. Okay. Then let's go in here. Is that me? Is that a picture of me? Oh dear. Okay, this is creepy. Hotline Seashell is a transmitter bridge. Directors can call the board long distance. <sighs> What's it with all the flashbangs today? Complete the astral plane challenge. Alright. What the heck? I don't like this. The hotline will allow you to contact extra dimensional entities. Oh shit. Oh. Oops. <laughs> Whoopsie boobins. Come but is this is this friend or foe? Am I shooting you, or am I not shooting you? I'm in contact. I, I, I'm not sure what's going on here. Am I shooting you or not? I mean, I don't see a health bar. Maybe I just have to avoid it. Maybe I'm just moving on. Not trying to get touched. Can't touch this. Can't touch this. Oh, don't fall down. Whee! Coming. Well done, dial director. It is a phone. <laughs> the... It's an object of power. It Oops. doesn't connect to any typical network. A direct line to the astral plane and the board. And my hypothesis is, under the right conditions to other planes of existence as well. Hello? 
A director needs a team. My management team. These people know the secrets of the Bureau as well as I do. Some even better. Darling, Tomasi, Salvador, Marshall. Marshall especially, my head of operations. She sees right through me. She knows I don't like relying on people. The only person you should fail is yourself. <laughs> but things change when you become director. Oh shit. Mission updated. Speak I have with it. Emily. The hotline. I can reach Trench. Well, listen to him. He feels more like an echo. An echo with important info. I need to get back to Emily. People react strongly when I tell them about you. Is it too soon to tell Emily? She might be able to help. Help with what? That hasn't been there before. That's new. There wasn't a door before. Where did you come from? What? Oh! Guys! You know, I was looking at this earlier and it was like, this is totally a way, but why can't it go there? Ha! Shortcut unlocked. Nice. I like. Maybe, hang on, can I fast travel? Oh, you have to go, mm hmm okay. You can only fast travel from one point to another. Hotline. Containment procedure. Object should be inaccessible for use except to the director. Object is a 1960s era red bake light telephone. The rotary dial has been replaced with a black knob of unknown purpose. The phone weighs. Why is the weight of the of the phone redacted must be something absolutely wild like either incredibly light or incredibly heavy the object allows the director to communicate with the <laughs> if used by anyone other than the director the object will cause lethal <laughs> see dr darling presentation bah, bah, bah. the object is currently bound to director trench background the object spontaneously manifests in the director's office placed on the desk Director Northmore was the first known bureau agent to use it. A battery of tests were run on the object, including mm -hmm and mm -hmm, but its origin remains unknown. Correspondence. What did I miss here? I don't see anything. Ah, okay. Multimedia. We already listened to those. Hotline. Trench control points. Hotline. Oh, no. Ah, you can just rewatch those. Okay. Okay, okay. Boom. <laughs> House memory. Memory. Okay, I'm here. I need to go all the way back and around. Uh, uh orientation zero. No. No. So we need to go back to Emily and Emily is wait a minute, can I open this now? Haha. <laughs> All of these level ones now that I can open. I love it. Um Objects of power are unique in their cap capacity to grant certain individuals paranatural abilities. We call these individuals para utilitarian oh god i can't i this is so hard for me to pronounce para utilitarians <laughs> utility which <laughs> is the potency of these abilities depend on the para utilitarian using the <laughs> object of power as an example some para utilitarians can achieve a throw distance of <laughs> while others are only capable of as little as <laughs> What exactly determines an individual's paranatural competence is unknown, but it is largely believed that some <laughs> exists within the body and that, like all muscles, it can be exercised. To continue my analysis, I have officially requested access to the Northmore records. Considering he is one of the most accomplished para para utilitarians the bureau has, bureau has ever seen, Dr. Darling is still considering this request. 
Disclaimer, I'm not a native English speaker, so <laughs> sometimes struggling with words like these. House memory, okay. Still don't know what to do with that, but I'm just looting everything, like the lootaholic that I am. Yup, yup. Oh, this was the radio, okay. I'm just looking if I, now that I have the access card, if I could open more things, you know. Like this one. Oh, clearance level four. Eh. Okay. Hello, sir. Mm, sorry, guys, for the zoomies and stuff, but I would really like to uh, go into every room that I can, you know. The moment that I unlock it. Okay. Jesse, did you get the hotline? I mean, how is it out there? The comms? The hiss? I sorry. Calm down. You made it. I made it, yeah. Emily? <laughs> Let me, let me just quickly. Analysis of His Threat, Part 1, Confidential Summary. Initial encounters with the entity known as the His have revealed various behavioral facts. Most notably, the His is able to invade or corrupt control points, altered items, and even humans, radically changing their behavior. Curiously, any person wearing one of the wearable HRA devices that Dr. Darling has been distributing over the past weeks was not affected by this corruption. The only known exception to this fact is the new director, Jesse Faden, who possesses an inherent immunity to the hiss. This could indicate that she has already been corrupted, but her behavior is so in contrast to that of the other hiss that I have dismissed the theory. My final observation comes from Miss Faden herself. She is able to cleanse material and organisms of the hiss corruption. We tested this ability on a hiss corrupted entity, but unfortunately the possessed seems to kill the host. Perhaps the host's physiology becomes reliant on the hiss. More work to be done. Refer the file <laughs> for full report. Let's talk. Of course. Let's talk. I got the hotline. I can make out what Trench is saying now. Incredible. What did he say? He talked about his management team. People who knew the Bureau of Secrets. Your boss, darling. Tomasi, but he's gone. He has gone. Salvador? He's the head of security. And Marshall? Helen Marshall is head of operations. She's tough, ex-CIA. She took her rangers and went to the research sector to secure the HRA production. She hasn't come back. Someone who could help us. The other sectors. How do I get there? It's impossible because of the internal lockdown. You can perform a directorial override to lift it, but that can only be done in the maintenance sector. Normally, you take the sector elevator down there. It connects all the sectors, but it won't work while the lockdown is in effect. We already got past one lockdown. Maybe I can find the way. Jesse, look, with no prep, no training in this extreme situation you are doing phenomenally well and all that and the hiss can't seem to affect you i mean i would love to run some tests on you if you agree that is we could find out something that would help us tests i don't like tests i don't know she might find out about you but i wouldn't mind understanding more myself okay if you think it will help Great. I'll check the internal documentation for any lockdown bypasses. We need to get these sectors open to locate Darling and Marshall. And I'll look for a way inside the maintenance sector. The sooner we find one, the sooner I reach this override. This feels like a chapter end. 
NSCO2. This looks intimidating. <laughs> Mission completed, unknown caller. Directorial, directorial override. Search for a way into the maintenance sector. Upgrade and unlock new abilities. Oh my god, nobody can read that fast. Mate! <laughs> I hear Ati again. Ooh. Looks like there's no dialogue Hi, with Jesse. her. Oh. Never mind. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. I, I just I just wanted to sit just down for a second. Know. Literally. <laughs> um search for a way into the maintenance sector, which is central executive. It said something about this um, Do you hear that? Someone's singing. Where is it coming from? This is totally Ati. Singing. It sounds like it's coming from the elevator. Objects up to twenty feet. Oh, Astro abilities, astro constructs. Obviously, what is this? Weapon forms and mods. Construct Shatter. Shatter has high stopping power with a scatter shot that devastates grouped enemies at close range. Required materials. I need more source for that, but I have enough unidentified reading and house memory. Ah, that's what you need those things for. Okay. And what's this? Weapon mods? Oh, I can craft them? Oh, what is this? Weapon mod common. Common, common, common. Personal mods. Skewer personal mod. Upgrade refresh mods. I don't understand how this works, really. You never read the piece. And I'm scared to use anything without knowing what I'm doing and then losing my materials and regretting everything. So I'm just gonna leave that out for now. Um, abilities. Plus 10 health, plus 10 energy, plus 10 melee damage, plus 10 launch damage. I have four of these. Are these like skill points now? I have four skill points, as you guys can see up there, and each one of those costs one. So can I scale all of these now? Atto is a Finnish sea god. Ati is the more common name for Ato, but Ato is used in the Finnish epic Kalevala uh, as to avoid confusion with Ati Saarelainen, the hero. So he's a god. <laughs> but it looks like I can literally craft all of, all of these right now. Or like, unlock all of these. But all of them seem quite nice. The last upgrade feels kind of like a downgrade from 30 to 15. Um, but I know it's like, it's it uh, adds up, but still. <laughs> Why starting from 10 and then you go to 30 and then you go down to 15 again is a bit weird. So I'm gonna use one of this, one of this. Milestone reward, additional weapon form slot. Oh, nice! Ah, YOLO. Come on. Okay, additional weapon Damn. form slot. I don't have new outfits, do I? No, okay. Board counter. Ati, I hear you. I hear you, all right. Weapon forms. Weapons mods. Personal mods. Health recovery plus 25 recovery per element pickup. Um, oof. I thought I have... Ooh! Ooh! No. Weapon forms, grip, and then there's something else. I have this unlocked, but I don't have anything that I could put in there. Looks like, so... Okay. Mission. Oh, oh, there's different missions that I could track? Completed missions. Oh, okay. Let's track it. The internal lockdown, an emergency security measure, is stopping Jesse from looking for Trench's missing management team in the other sectors. Jesse sets out to enter the maintenance sector to find the directorial, directorial override and lift the internal lockdown. Okay. Bergele. I'm coming, Ati. The is supposed to have a designated security team here for our protection. Where the hell are they? If the internal lockdown is in effect, then they can't use the elevator to reach us. We're on our own. I can't believe they didn't think of these things when they installed the lockdown system. 
I know, right? Uh, I think I've been there already. So, do I need to go this way? Ooh, ooh, ooh. There you no, never mind. Oh, Ati, where the heck are you? I hear you clearly. Time to work. Meet me in the maintenance. Maintenance. <laughs> I love the way he talks. Central executive. Is this maintenance sector? Let's go. Like I said before, the janitor is a friendly face. Very friendly. What you listen to, Adi. You can upgrade a launch to pick up enemy grenades and rockets and use them against the attacker. Yeah, that's pretty cool. The maintenance sector is the janitor domain. If I can find Ati here, he can help me reach the override. Maybe it was you who got me into the oldest house with the lockdown on. Maybe it was Ati. It felt like he made the elevator appear that took me to Trench's office. Is Ati guiding me too? Mm-hmm, I guess so, yeah. Better than no face at all. No face would also creep me out. Ah, oh, clearance too, so I, can't, I, I cannot go in there. <coughs> These sounds reminded me of, um, oh god. Apes Exodus and stuff. Apes Odyssey. I don't know if you guys know these games. I got this gifted from my cousin when I was younger and she got herself a- The directorial a override is right there, in the control room. How do we get there? Uh, when she got herself a PlayStation 2 and I got her old PlayStation X and all the games with it. There is a lot of floating guards around there and I'm not really uh, looking forward to facing them. Hopefully it's gonna be timed and not all of them at once. Use the chunky force. Oh, hang on. Is this an object of power? <laughs> it's all jiggly jiggly, you know? Charge maneuvers accept. Countermeasures. Oh, is this like challenges or something? Kill enemies with a service weapon in charge mode. Charge into the field. It's the art commercial of war. So I accept them and then I get rewards if I do them. Kill his rangers. They know how to use your solid soldiers, humans, toys, smart. Kill his demolition experts. Kill enemies with a service weapon in shatter mode. Kill his guards in the exact. Okay, I can't. I oh, can you just have three active? Kill his guards in exactly sector. Okay. Well, astro construct. Okay. I guess we'll just maybe automatically do them. Hey. 
Dang it. Mamma mia. Can I? Someone was shooting. I don't know where it came from. Damn. Throwing shit at people and killing them that way is kind of satisfying, I have to say. In video games, of course. <laughs> Disclaimer. Okay, what's this? Uh, I can't go in there yet. Oof. What's this? Am I gonna find a shoebox and a... <laughs> no, I'm not. Okay. Sadness. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yoink! Health recovery personal mod, okay. Wait, maybe that's better than what I have right now. Do I have a second slot for personal mods? I do not. 26, this is the exact same, okay. Oh. <laughs> jittery, jittery. Oh, darn it! Gender's office. Talk What's down that way? Oh, I hear the humming. Oh, oh, oh. Lloyd, da da Mary Chase. New mission hold to activate. Investigate the strange light in the break room. Oh. Bro. <laughs> Cleanse the merry-go-round horse object of power. Oh, this place makes me nauseous. An object of power. How do you think it got down here? Um I was I was thinking I'm falling right now. <laughs> Carousel horse. Why is kid stuff always so creepy? <laughs> Use evade to complete the astral. Okay, how do I use evade? B. Oh shit! Oh. Oops. can invade in the air. What are you? Gold enemies are immune to Jesse's attacks. So why should I bother? Should I just be running? Oh. Oh. Flashbang. Let's see the Hess keep up with me now. This is cool! Oh. Blinded by the light. Do, do, do. I don't think I can go this far. No, can I? Oh, I can, never mind. I didn't say. Oh shit, man, this is bright! Ugh. Oh my god. Lord, oh my god, could you 
Somebody turn up that light. Oh, I fell back down. Okay, never mind. I thought <laughs> I thought I died now. <laughs> it's like wow, they literally spawned me right next to a massive um hole in the ground and I instantly die. <laughs> Nasty. It's a weird, crazy alien dimension. The white goes on forever. You can get lost in all that white and never find your way back home. I miss my home. What's it with the fax noises? <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> moving on. Oh my god, what's it with Remedy and these very weird, and I mean weird, TV shows and TV episodes that you can find? Although I had to say, I love the Koskala brothers and and their TV ads that they <laughs> that they run. They're just hilarious. Um. Oh, new map. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh shit! Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> Wrong button. I always click B for back, and then I'm not. I'm not going back. <laughs> I'm, I go forward. Yeet! Energy renewal weapon mod. Energy renewal exclusive to grip pierce spin. Seventeen percent energy gain from headshots. Ooh. Scatter projectile boost exclusive to scatter. I don't have scatter yet. Oh. Okay. Oh, wait, there was more. Assets. Conceptual material. Okay. Mission. Uh, okay, these are the countermeasures, and this is what I. Okay. Hey, he's on a poster, just like in Alan Wake. Just a poster of Ati, the janitor. Makes sense. Well done. You got the job. It's place for congratulations. Yippee, Sadama. It happened in the last drop. I truly need an assistant. Funny thing is, I've been a janitor. I'm more at home in that role than as the director. Only Ati here seems to see that. Yeah, hi, Ati. Look, we need to get the lockdown lifted, otherwise I can't get to the other sectors. Can you help me get to the override? Yes, yes. Easy peasy. <laughs> it's just around the corner. But first, we need to get you working. Very small couple of hours job. Okay. Something tells me it's gonna be more than that. Mm, yeah, me too. Uh, uh, yeah, hi, uh, uh, you think there's a dog buried in this? What? I can tell you are not the yesterday's grouse's son. That's why you make a great assistant. 
very well. I'll hit the facts on the table. You do that. I'm not going to say I'm going to say this house has a vermin problem. A bad one. Oh. They've already messed up the cooling pumps. And the power generators of a power plant. Bergele. Bergele. The pensioner inside. <laughs> He's starting to feel the band around his head tighten. The situation needs to be fixed before the plant blows up. And we all disappear like a fart in Sahara. <laughs> what? I'm my best to keep up with this. Yeah. Fix the coolant pumps and the power generators. Otherwise, the power plant will blow. But don't you worry. I've left you clear instructions. Thank you, Ati. You'll catch the end of the trip before I go to my vacation. Vacation. The work's on the task board here. You can do later, when you have time. Vacation? Right. Seems Ish, like a weird time no for vacation. Gonna cancel my holiday or seat's gonna rattle. But don't worry at all. You'll take care of it and soon this crisis gonna be last winter snow. You better go now, so you don't have to run with your head as your third leg. The door in the back leads to the plant. The door in the back. Okay. That's great. Thank you, Ati. Okay, I don't understand Finnish, but I have a suspicion that um, with all these weird things that he says, that these are Finnish sayings that he just translates literally, like word for word. And that's why they make zero sense to us. <laughs> but they're like, how you say them in, in Finnish. The Scandinavian people, they have some very funny um, sayings, like you can't just slide in there like a shrimp sandwich and stuff like that in Sweden, for example, or something like that. So <laughs> I think this is one of those cases. Ah, the door in the back, nice. And what's this, Ati, what is this? What a mess, burn the trash. Yep. Hold to activate. Burn, burn the trash the around the furnace. Throw it into fire. Ooh. Okay. Burn it all. Burn it all. Burn it into a reindeer, not into a moose. <laughs> the way he just like vibes with his mop. Oh. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> He's just the greatest. I love him, man. He's so weird. Uh, and the way he talks. <laughs> can I open this now? Ooh, damn. We can open all the things now. Nice. I love it. Boom. Yeah, idiom. Ah, idioms is the word you say. Yeah. Stuff in the furnace, so... Oh, shit. Oop, that was the wrong button. So, oh, oh, oh. Hang on. Is there a door? Is it this way? You don't appreciate music? <laughs> they can't go as far as pepper grows. I want to go... <clears throat> Now is the part where the map is kicking me in the butt. So, I want to go down here, but maybe I should go this way. I, I don't know. Up here? Okay, so what happens again if that thing blows up? Power. Explosion. Boom. Big bada boom. Too much. Director's duty. Oh, my duty. Keep the lights on. My duty is to keep the lights on. Now I'm going this way. I oh. <laughs> Whoops! I didn't mean to go this way. I don't know how to get to the little side quest that I wanted to activate there. You know, over over there, the yellow question marks. I'm gonna just explore a little bit, but I need to select some other missions, I guess. Directors override. Find a find a way to fix the NSC power plant. Let's do this then. Then at least I I know where I gotta go, kinda ish. This way. Oh, hello. Okay. Boop. Boopity boop. Use the signs on the wall to find locations. I'll try. Arish escaped OOP. An object of power escaped the 
Panopticon a couple of weeks ago and they want everyone to keep an eye out for it. So if anyone sees a merry-go-round horse zipping around the sector, alert me immediately. Do not try to contain it on your own and definitely don't bind it to yourself. Your security chief, Simon Arish. Arish? I don't know. Uh, well, we kind of already did the thing with the horsey thing, so... Uh, whoopsie poopins. Um. NSC power plant. Boom. Are you friendly? You, I don't know, you, you're holding a shotgun, but you are not possessed yet, so... Are you good? Hey! Hey, are you new? Then go talk with Chief Arish in the security booth. Arish. He's in charge here. Okay, ma'am, can I, can I get one of those weapons that you have? Is that a rocket launcher? Can I have that? <laughs> I want one of these. Shelter. Come on. World War One MG. Oof. Big badonka chonka boom boom. You are locked and you're locked for good. Well, this place is big. I already see myself fighting something really nasty in here. Ma'am, if you're here to help, you should speak with Chief Arish. He's in the security booth. I'm already on it. Ma'am! Hey! Ma'am! Chief Arish, FBC security. Yes, let me read this real quick. <laughs> let me just let me just barge into your office and grabbing anything that I can find and then reading it while you talk to me. Hey Simon, I got your message. Yeah, if someone in the sector is asking about Ati, just tell him you'll handle it and leave it at that. Under no circumstance should any personnel intervene with his day-to-day -day routine. I told you everything I know about him, so you, you could better deal with his odd habits. But yes, it's still very much a classified matter. Also, I saw your report about the quarry worker who wandered into the foundation. Detaining him was the right move. We'll figure out what he saw before we decide on next steps. Cheers, Lynn. P.S. In case you hadn't noticed, something is up between Trench and Darling. I know this isn't your strong suit, but try your best to stay out of it. Interesting. Very interesting. Didn't you be in a safe room? <laughs> His facial expression is funny. Okay, let's talk. Hi. They all have HRAs. We're on the same side. My name is Jesse Faden. I'm here to perform the directorial override to get the lockdown lifted. Yeah, yeah. Chief Arish, FBC Security. I'm just... Oh, hang on. We have a new director. <laughs> huh. Yeah, hi. Uh, it's a pleasure, ma'am. Let's skip the formalities, please. Right. Faden, ma'am. Look, as you can probably tell, it's a bit of a shit show down here. We've been holding our ground, but whatever's gotten into our buddies has them wrecking the coolant pumps and the power converters. The NSC keeps overheating, and my crews keep getting shot before they have a chance to make any repairs. Mm -hmm. NSC? Oh, sorry. Bureau jargon. It's what we call the power plant. You know, the uh, big rumbling metal thing? <laughs> uh, Salvador, head of security, asked me to protect it in case of an attack. See, what's inside is dangerous. Dr. Darling seemed to know it would be a target. Darling? He's here? No, he came down a few days ago, before everything went to hell. He was out of it. He smelled like a bar mat. He was ranting about vulnerabilities and how he only had one large-scale HRA, but that he needed it somewhere else. Still, at least he gave us these personal HRAs before he left. Hey, did I mention that he was tearing his clothes off? <laughs> Crazy dude. Darling knew the hiss was coming. Listen. I love playing 20 questions as much as the next guy, but we have got to get the water and electrical systems repaired before this piggy blows. I'll have my guys unlock the doors out of here for you. I'll take care of it. You stay and keep the hiss away from the plant if you can. The hiss? That's what we're calling him? Yep. That's catchy. <laughs> oh, listen, the radios aren't working, so if you find my boss Salvador out there, could you please ask him what the plan is? I'm sure he will have one by now. I'll keep an eye out for him. He sure has a lot of faith in his boss. <laughs> Try to stay alive. Fix the NSC coolant pumps, fix the NSC energy converters. Blockages in pipe C through F. He seemed awkwardly nervous about talking to me. 
Boom. Threshold remnant. Hello. Okay, so... Let's see where I gotta do the things. I guess up here somewhere. Let's clear this first so we have a fast travel point. Oh, she didn't do the thing on the ground. Abilities? Oh, I have three... Ooh, I have three points. I don't know where I get these all the time. Do you pick them up? Do you... Uh, do you just give get them for XP? Oh, how, how is things happening? But 50% more launch damage might be good. I, I really like to use that. Let's go. Bonk. Construct spin. Construct sca oh. Construct. So shatter is a type of the weapon. I Just like I modify it in a way. And then the shatter sounds like it's going to be more of a shotgun kind of thing. If I'm understanding this correctly. I'm losing quite a few materials though for that. It's a shotgun. I like to have a shotgun, but I, I would hate to trade in this thing for this thing. I would like to have both. I, I like the weapon that I have. You will have materials to get everything. So I can sw switch between them anytime. Okay, let's try that out. Scatter. And now I can put... Let me get this right. Aha, uh -huh, okay. And I can put a mod in there. Projectile spread exclusive to shatter, so I can have less spread, actually. Okay. Projectiles fire, plus two, that's good. Projectile spread, minus six. Ammo refund chance on hit. I think maybe this is good. More, more projectiles fired. Health recovery per element picked up. Okay. Wait a minute. Got a tier two. Health recovery per element picked up. Right now, what do we have? Health plus... 26. This is better. Okay. Did I get another slot for these? No. So how do I switch weapons? Ah, switch weapon form. Oh! Oh! Handy dandy! Okay. I love it! Okay, that's nice. I was scared that it's gonna be a trade-off. You have to decide... Either you have a pistol or you have a shotgun. And while I really do love me a shotgun, I really, really do. It's one of my favorite weapons. Um, I would hate to... I, I really like to have distance between certain enemies as well. And a shotgun is re not really a distance weapon, is it? <laughs> my two favorite weapons are sniper rifles and shotguns. One for range, for like really, really far range. And one for in-your-face combat. What's with a creepy scream. Okay, dramatic music. Boom! Oh shit. with you oh my god this is creepy i don't like this oh god they explode hey yo <laughs> hey yo the hell they were creepily possessed i'm loving it oh lord Eating stuff around is my thing. Get your own thing. Oh no. Okay, got him. I think. And I think combat is over. Okay, good. Nice. Eh, eh, okay, we're not going in there. What's up here? Converters. Okay, this is the first way we gotta go. Big bada boom! My favorite kind of boom. The big bada type. Oh, 
shit. Replace the parts. I'm kind of scared sometimes of the effect that um, grabbing stuff can have. I died, I think, two times now by grabbing stuff and then it accidentally, you know, landing too close to me. I got another ability? Are you kidding me? Oh, it's this stuff again. That's gonna kill me, isn't it? Maintenance NSC energy converters. Yeah, I figured. Oh, this is gonna hurt me. Fix the coolant. Am I not in the converter area? How do I fix? Oh, up this? This maybe? It looks like it needs fixing. Do we need fixing? I can fix you. See? Maybe this? There's a red button. I can press it. No? Hmm. I don't like that sound. Me neither. Was I too late? Wait a minute. Can I combine these with that? Do, do I just need to place one of these there? Okay. It's fried up. You need to fix it before the whole inside the plant has a shit. Oh, text, go away. Go away, text. <laughs> oh, boom. Darn it. Coming for you, sir. Give me a minute. With you shortly. Nom, 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 nom. Hey, guys, by the way, I know I saw some comments like, Liz, think, think. The thing is that I didn't even realize that these were kind of batteries and that I need that I could do anything with them, you know? I thought they were just maybe stuff like explosives. Okay, where do I need to put you? Oh, there. <laughs> oh, hello. of a rotten gun who was that was that you oh shit oh. oh shit mamma mia so yeah this I had one of these puzzles um, where you had to take a, a square object and put it into something else, but it was so abstract that I didn't realize this. So that was my first kind of approach with these types of puzzles, which is why I didn't know what I was doing. So just to justify my blindness in the matter. Is there a second one where I have to put things? Oh yeah, nice, you can climb up that way. I like that she's a bit more agile than Ellen. Ellen is just like, you know, he's sitting on his ass all day typing. <laughs> it's like, I'm not bending the knee to climb up anything. Forget about that. <laughs> uh. Hi, welcome in everybody. I'm doing good, how are you all? So...
what's next? I need to put one more at least. Yeet. Aha! Got him. Bam! We're fixed. Now let's fix the pumps and water flow. Hell yeah! Look at Jesse go! <laughs> Wee! Ritual impulse. The what now? Okay. <laughs> okay. Fix the NSC coolant pumps. Okay, the other way around. <laughs> Dead end. Da, 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 da. What's this? Ooh. Okay, you can also walk this way. Coolant pumps, this way. Look at me reading the signs! <laughs> Attack, attack incoming. You freak me out. Ooh. Oh, hell no. I don't know if I hate or like that they explode when they die. I'm not sure yet. What's with this screeching? That was cool. Creepy. And cool. I vote for hate. <laughs> mm. Threshold remnant, okay. Is this the way I gotta go? Power plant, cooling pumps, nice. And furnace chamber. Furnace chamber. Yoink. <laughs> Hi everybody, welcome in. I always think I can pick things up, I think I can loot these, but I'm pretty certain they're just for yeeting purposes. Yeet. Need to replay this game, it has been so long. Love it, and the pose of the fall music in it. Oh, there he is! Maybe that's later, or maybe that's the music that is copyrighted, and which, which I have muted. Where you at? Screeching my luckus. Stay the hell away from me, please. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's the way, uh huh, uh huh. I hate it, uh huh, uh huh. You, you little dodgy bastard. Don't explode in my face, please. Ooh. Easy, I wasn't panicking. Not at all. <laughs> mm. oh, actually, a good idea. Thanks for the stretch. Which way am I supposed to go? Uh-huh. This is progress, this is extra. Let's go extra first. Furnace chamber. <gasps> I hear music! Okay, I have fully healed up and everything, so let's go. Oh dear. <laughs> oh lord. What's up with all the lights, man? I have I'm a gamer, okay? 
I when I go outside, I need sunglasses because it's so bright. My poor gamer eyes are not used to this. What is this? Do you want to blind me? Okay. Is this one of these side thingies where I have to... <gasps> Wait a minute. Is this where I just need to use the... Oh, hang on. By trash, did Ati mean barrels full of hazardous biological material? It sounds like I'm breaking some environmental regulations on waste disposal, but if that's what Ati wants, My name is Dr. then I'll get it done. Lead researcher of the parakinesiology. I believe... I've discovered a code Omega paranatural entity residing within the Bureau itself. Rose? Right under our noses. Darling refused to allocate me the budget or resources, so... So I'm taking matters into my own hands. Let this recording be the proof I need to convince them. The furnace can speak. What? It's been talking to me for some time now. What? Listen. Did you hear that? No. It's a sentient force capable of communicating. I checked and, and there's no record of, of ever installing this furnace. I believe that... Oh, oh, sorry. What? Yes, I can feed you. Uh, what do you eat? I see. Uh, I'll try to find some volunteers. Humans? Was it humans? Think the furnace wants to eat humans? Oh dear. Okay. Three more, I think. I better not risk it for the biscuit. <laughs> Let's play it safe. Oh man, I love this stuff, guys. This game is so much fun to play. Apart from all the white screens and like flashbang screens that they add all the time, that's like ugh, a bit unnecessary, but okay, I'm living with it. Sing it, Ati! Sing it! You're... You're just... Oh boy. You're just the normal stuff. Hang on. You ain't what I'm looking for. Maybe there's more stuff up here? Please don't explode in my face. Thank you. You don't need to get close to the furnace. I want to play it safe. I'm, I'm scared that I accidentally mess things up, you know? Volunteers. <laughs> what, one or two more? Please don't break. Oh boy. Okay, one more. Come on, give me another. I want more, more, more. No, you're not what I'm looking for. Nope. Come on, I need one more. Not, not this. This. But then maybe not as thorough and definitely not again on the hardest difficulty. I played Horizon Zero Dawn on ultra hard on my first playthrough and it was grindy. So grindy. Oh, you get, you get, you get extra stuff. I got some materials for this. Cool. All right, fix the NSC colon pumps. What's this? Mail tube complaint. Charged. Oh, we haven't read this yet. Okay. The his charged agents are examples of extreme physical deformation resulting from his corruption. 
His charge display an unthinking fixation on any non-corrupted individuals in the area. Once within a specific proximity, they erupt into a burst of focused his resonance, so dense that it acts as a physical force. The his charge is depleted of his... Oh boy. Depleted of the his corruption after this eruption. Corruption, eruption. Yo. Uh, the host is left lifeless. This behavior may be an adaptive response to the HRAs. The his charge are designed to blow the devices off potential hosts, exposing them to the resonance. Is the his capable of customizing a corrupted host's altered ability to this degree? Why is the physiology of the his charge so dramatically different from the host's original form? Lots of questions, no answers. Refer to file, redacted for full report. Doop, 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 doop. Correspondence. Da, ah, there. Hey, Bozer, get this. Uh, the accounting department still says they haven't received my expense reports. They say the receipts probably got lost in the mail tubes because of a shift or a threshold or some such fuckery. And that if I don't have the originals, they can't verify my expenses for reimbursement. This is such bullshit. Why do we even use these fucking tubes if they just spit out mail out in some other goddamn dimension? Just venting here before I make a formal complaint. Unless uses pieces of shit, Rodriguez. <laughs> But seriously, that makes little sense though, does it? I totally agree with Rodriguez here. If you know that the physical room around you is constantly changing, <laughs> why would you make these kind of tubes to deliver mail when it's very likely that they're just gonna change direction and like teleport the, the mail somewhere else so nobody ever hears from it? Why not use bloody emails? I mean, this is from, from what game is this playing in? And these are the mail tubes, right? These things. I <laughs> got it. Okay. So. Oh. Hang on, this is explosive, right? Yeah. Thank God I didn't use this. So close. You think I could? Oh, oh lord. Oh, oh, I did it, but I can't open it. Can I? Darn it! Oh, man, <laughs> such a good idea. I can't believe this worked. Nice materials. Come on, love, you can climb up there. I believe. Do you believe in climbing stuff? Oh my god, come on, I tried so hard. Have I been down there? Yo. Shit, oh, oh crap, oh no. <laughs> I always click B when I go backwards. What are you? Are you TV? I think I broke it. But how does it play stuff without being connected to a power source? Sturdy TV. The Nokia of TVs. Through here? Oh boy. I got sidetracked and then I lost my sense of orientation. So there's no pumps. Hurry. This is where I need to be. Oh, what the heck? I'm running! Uh, hang on. My, my, my shoulder changed. There. My shoulder changed. You know what I mean, right? My my camera orientation change. Son of a gun. What, do we just hop down here? Oh, yeah, we do. Yes, we do. Boom. Oh, my God. I love this. And a sea coolant pumps. Bro, bro. Or to shift it. Fix it fast. If the plant goes boom, we can throw the spoon in the corner. Not the spoon! Archie, no! Not the spoon! Okay, we need we need we need to place the thingy majigs, right? We need to face place the thingy oh my god. Is this is this one of these cases where the the game tells you do it fast but you have all the time in the world? 
I always feel like I really have to make, you know, make a hurry, make haste when they say stuff like that. I have a feeling it's one of those, yeah. My old enemy, the clock, is blocking the pipes. You need to deal with that shit. He is very clever. He is trying to sneak in. We caught him caught with his hand in the fist. Oh, dear. Ew. What the fuck? It's the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. Yes, amen to that, sister. What the hell? Ew. Ew. <laughs> what the actual... What is this? Suddenly risen evil? Kill the orange orbs and... And orange eyes and stuff, and then, oh my god! Be gone, foul creature! Yikes. Big yikes. Big yucky. <laughs> Dr. Pimple Popper's over there. <laughs> you. Dodge efficiency. Ooh. I like the dodge the way it is. Uh, this way now? Looks like it. Yep. Blech. Yeah, it's very school thing. Just hold together a little longer. Come on, Furnace, you can do it! Oh, wait, this is the exit. Did I just go in a, in a circle right there? But it didn't fix nothing yet. <laughs> Am I in the wrong place again? Kinda. Pipe works. Did I just have to clear the pipe works? Is that it? You just sent me in a, in a circle and now I need to go back? Uh huh. Now we have these. Oh no, we had them already before. Never mind. But we don't. We didn't have anything to to put them in, right? You look like you could be some pumpity thing. Um. Oh lord! I hear these floaty malakas. Hold on, hold on! It still out of ammo? Oh lord! Oh lord! Oh lord! Oh lord! Oh lord! Hang on, sorry, I gotta go through. Coming through, coming through. Oh shit. Oh, this is bad. Oh ma. Come on, heal. Heal, 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 heal. Are you critting me? Are you kidding me? One HP in a dream, guys. One HP in a dream. Are you dead? Give me healing. Malaka. Ooh. 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 Oh, that was close. Way too close. Come on, I killed more things. Give me, give me stuff. Give me some healing. <laughs> <sighs> I've got these things. 
we need to put more of these battery chargey thingies somewhere, but I don't know where. I don't see the, the slots where to go. I wish you could, you know, destroy them before they become conscient and stuff. We need, maybe I need to go up there. Hang on, let me try. My adrenaline is pumping after that. Oh yeah, I see. Not this, you. This. Not, not this. Thank you. Ching. No, there's gotta be more. There's gotta be nasties. Oh, maybe now is not a good time to read it, though. They do the big butter boom. We have more. Still get the combat music, so that makes me think there's more. Oh, yeah, pew pew pew. Okay, silence. Ah, nice. <gasps> Is this Jedi powers? Well, Jesse has. I sadly don't. I wish I had. That'd be cool. Where to now? I think I haven't checked over here yet. Out of my way. Text, no more text. Nice and quiet, lovely. Uh, he's a bit big, you know, like. Research records. Ah, na, 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 na. It was nice of them to show him before he actually appeared in front of you. <laughs> so you could prepare by grabbing something to yeet at him. That was... <laughs> that's <laughs> that was nice. Here's some strange music. If the internal lockdown using uh oh uh oh who are you who oh there going on here oh lord oh lord oh come on come on Leo. can i have your gun that seems pretty cool i, I want it
Junior agent something something. Sometimes I could swear I hear this Wilhelm scream, you know this? Do we do it? You okay, mate? Lady? <laughs> Have I been up here before? Abilities. Ooh, we got a few abilities. Okay, nice. What do we want? More health, more energy, more melee damage. Launch grenades and rockets back at enemies. Sounds pretty cool to me. Let's go. Collect reward. Col collect reward. Nice. Okay, you can only have three of those um, active at, at a time, I, s I think. Okay, I've also been around here. Let me talk to... Uh, Arish? Arish? When the converters and coolant pumps are working again, we should be able to get this baby back down to a safe temperature. I hope. Oh, we can have... Okay. What do you know about the hiss? Not much. Only what I've seen. Well, they use the same tactics that Marshall and Salvador taught us, which makes me think that the hiss haven't completely erased the people inside, which is a pretty fucking horrible thought. Or they're just using whatever they find in their victims' heads. In any case, they are really eager to get inside the power plant. Why do you think that is? Shit, I don't know. They want to make my life harder? What do you do here, Arish? Security chief of the maintenance sector. I make sure all the weird shit down here doesn't bother the maintenance crews. <laughs> Learned everything I know from Salvador. The best security agent this bureau has ever seen. And you like your job? I love it. You know, everyone thinks that maintenance is the lowest rung on the ladder just because we fix pipes instead of writing memos, but I gotta be honest. These are the bravest people in the goddamn building. I'm proud to work with them. I've done a few odd jobs with these kind of folks. They say what they mean. I like that. I like that too. What exactly is the power plant? Listen, I only know what Salvador told me, um. but I know it generates all the electricity for the Bureau. And it's got two very simple rules. Rule one, keep it below a certain temperature. Rule two, don't ever, ever open it. Oh, and three, uh, it's classified, so I shouldn't ask. Sounds like okay. secrets are standard operating procedure around here. Oh, yeah, it's all part of the job. What do you know about the service weapon? Not much. I think it's director only. Salvador told me by the time he saw Trench use it. Sounds like that gun can do some serious damage. Yeah, I did see pictures of it once, though, and uh, it looks different to that thing you're carrying. You monitor or something? It's new. Is new a good thing? Given the circumstances, I'd say new is our best bet. <laughs> Ati. Do you know this Ati guy? <laughs> of course. He's my favorite coffee break buddy. Yay. Dude has got some crazy stories. And he probably knows more than anyone else around here. If you can make sense of what he's saying. Any idea where he's from? I'm guessing Sweden. Finland. Uh, he's from where he's from. Look, there are just some stones that are better left unturned, you know? Okay. I should be going. Right. You got a lockdown to lift. Indeedy. Lift the internal lockdown using the directional... Directoral... Directorial override. I swear I can't read, guys. I, I promise. I don't know it's, if it's saved you now, guys, but it's quite late already, and um, I've been going a bit longer than I expected i was having so much fun so i kind of lost track of time i think it saved if not we can just talk to him again i should really stop it now but guys i'm enjoying this so much i'm so glad that i picked this up now and decided to play it now i think the gameplay is just so so fluent and so fun the resonance when you're shooting is re very cool as well the enemies are interesting and there's quite the variety to it there's also lots of story which i like it's a quite a bit of uh, reading which I don't mind too much it's not it's not too bad I was just kind of spoiled from Alan Wake 2 where there was the option to have it being read to you that's when we will continue I'm looking forward to that I don't look forward to having a break of this because I would like to play more